Hello everyone, what is going on? Welcome to another episode of All the Mod 7 to the Sky. Alright, so today's a big day. Oh, spoilers, spoilers, spoilers. Uh, I'm going to build the All the, all the Modium Star. I have everything, this is what we've been getting up to, and let's just get right into it. So, um, I was going to do this really cool thing where I had it set up on the schematic cannon and I was going to shoot it onto there. And then I accidentally had it set up. So, uh, I guess my big reveal was kind of ruined. Because I don't know how to like undo this. I could maybe break blocks, but I don't know if it will like lose any of these items. I don't know. I didn't really want to risk it. So, let's just get right into it. It's a lot less climactic than I was hoping. Um, I stopped it the second I could. But uh, let's, well, let's, just, let's just get right into that. It'll work in theory. So, truth be told, I don't know what to expect. But well, let's see. Oops. Moment of truth. Did I do this right? Yes, I did. So I got it. Hooray. <laughs> uh, I had such a cooler plan. But I've never used the schematic cannon and I did it one time and it was all weird. So I uh. Anyways, I have it. <laughs> um, that's kind of a big deal. So... See, I don't know if I want to save it or like or what to do now. So like, do I go for the block and then try to get into bees to duplicate it? Do I like just keep working on building and going through different mods or like what, 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 what do you think I should do? Um, I was ugh, a little annoyed by my finale over there, but uh, <laughs> I had such big goals for this too. I'm like, oh yeah, the schematic cannon. It will build some hype, and uh, uh, I forgot I had it on the second time I set it up, and then it just started building it immediately. So, yeah. <laughs> but I got it. So uh, that's not going to be the whole episode, obviously, because that would be a one-minute episode. Um, Master of all. All right, well, for now, let's just get rid of these. You're dumb. And so I, I really don't know what to do. I don't know if I want to start a new pack now or if I want to, like, get the block or just go super hard on creative motors or something and start playing with create. I don't know. Let's look at the things here. So I haven't touched bees. I didn't really want to. Um, power, yeah, I have lots of power, um, mechanism, I could go for, like, the mecha suit, and honestly, a lot of this I probably already have, I never, never did the ore, but I don't really need to, ours, I wouldn't mind getting more into that, Batania, I kind of scratched the surface of it, I don't know, it's a cool mod. Blood magic, I haven't started. So maybe that's our goal today, is get into blood magic and see what we can do. Yeah. Yeah, let's, let's get into blood magic. And I think that's the only mod I really, like the Twilight, I did kind of beat most of these. I haven't gone past here. I could try to beat these more. Um, but yeah, today, let's get into blood magic, I guess. All right, so let's just get right into this. We're going to do some blood magic today. And again, I've never done that before. So I don't know why I'm still wearing this charm. It doesn't even give me night vision, even though it's supposed to. 
Unless that's like turn it on or something, maybe? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. Anyways, let's get right into this. So, do blood magic. Sweet, thank you. Well, let's make our first thing. We need an altar and a knife. Isn't it blood altar? Furnace. I think I can make that. And I need this knife. <clears throat> I don't know how much space this mod needs. I know there's like some weird things you can build around. I don't know. Well, let's just start it. Um, let's start it inside here and then we'll move it later when we have to. So let's just start it right here. So I know if I use this knife on myself, I'll take some damage. I don't think it will kill me, but see how this thing's filling up with blood? So, let's just see. Yes, I have my backpack to auto-eat. Um, let's just see if I can actually kill myself. Okay. I didn't think you could actually fully die. <laughs> um, cool. So, let's <clears throat> I have two of ten buckets. All right. So that's the first step. Now let's go from there. Um, what all there? Yeah. All right. Let's just check the progression. I'm mostly just trying to go through the progression. Okay. Portable light, a uh, weak blood orb. I'm pretty sure I get that if I, I throw a diamond in here. Let's see. Oh, there we go. All right, I'm pretty sure that's working. There we go. I think I can like door that. Hmm. I'm not sure. Oh, I think I have to just have it in my hand. Yeah. Let's get some sandwiches because clearly I'm not eating fast enough. That going up? I don't know what's happening. No, it's going down. Hmm. Well, cool. I almost want to set up a regen beacon or something. <laughs> Anyways, collecting the will. Oh. 
Uh-oh. 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 Why aren't you automatically shutting off? Okay. You good? No damage, just no fuel. Okay. I'm glad this system worked. <laughs> Don't mess with me. So I am trying to collect a whole bunch of antimatter because I'm kind of thinking about getting the block, the all the all the modium block. I don't know if I can go all the way into bees if I need two blocks. That seems ridiculous. But uh, yeah, I'm trying to get a lot of resources. But that's for another day. So where was it? All right. So I need will. I need snares. Okay, so I need to kill some mobs with snares. All right. I'll take that. Get rid of this. Still not full yet, eh? That's okay. Um, string. Can I do a whole stack at a time? No. Cool. Got a snare. Six buckets, still going down quite a bit. Okay. Sweet. <laughs> so I have to go kill some mobs, I guess. Do you count as a mob? All right, let's make it nighttime and then we Hello, mobs. Well, all right, so I got a couple of these demon wills now. So now I'm going to throw some stone in here. Now I'm pretty sure I can automate this. So if I go like this. Put that in there, and then take this out. Oh, I think we need a filter, clearly. So now, If I put stone in here, it should work. But that uses quite a bit of blood or life essence. So let that do its thing. I need two of these. I wonder if I could just make a beacon. Good. Hmm. All right, so I moved it over. I got the, the beacon set up. It's not really helping that much, but it'll help a little bit. So let's just take this guy off, get a little bit more blood. All right, so our next goal is this alchemy table. Pretty sure it has to be kind of close. Hmm. Oops. All 
Oh, right. So these are all inputs and stuff. Don't know how to use that yet. Okay. <laughs> Arcane Ashes. Okay, so you need redstone, white dye, gunpowder, and coal. Redstone, gunpowder, white. Die. And what was the other one? Um, I don't remember. Cool. Okay. If I just go like this. So I think that's doing something. I don't really know how to fill this up, but cool. Thanks. Okay, we got that done. Insert two items in it by right clicking in the blah, 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 blah. Okay, cool. Yeah, I don't care about making lava. I do want this though. So, wait, what was that? Redstone and blink lake. I'm pretty sure I just put this on the ground. Take redstone, a blank slate. Nothing happened. Hmm. Oh, I took all of my blank slates too. Weird. Okay, thanks, bud. Oh, I had to do that first. Okay, let's make another slate. Oh, give me them back. Maybe there's going to be one of each. I don't know. Let's see. There we go. Have a cool animation. Sweet divination of sigil. Sigil. So tell me what things are doing, I guess. Wait. Okay, cool. Thanks. Okay, cool. These ones I don't care about. So now let's get into the Hellforge. Just to save a little bit of time on this episode, I'll be right back after I make it. All right, so let's do our next item. We're gonna make the Petty Gem. I'm pretty sure, again, just go like this. And we'll give it one of these. Now, I think if I just throw these on the ground. Yeah, see, they fill that up. Sweet. So diamond, redstone block, and lapis block. Go. 
redstone block, lapis block, diamonds. And what was the other item I needed? That's it. Feel like that should work. Oh, I think I need a second one of these. All right, let's go organize real quick. All right, so I should have enough. I got this to 60. I think I put this in here. Aha, I had to kill a lot of mobs to get that full. Sweet, now I have. A lesser one. Sweet, thanks. All right. So I'm just going to keep upgrading those and then I'll be right back. All right. So I, I'm good enough for now. It's, I think the sword's taking all the whatever. We'll get to that later. So let's upgrade our, our ruin or altar. We're going to upgrade that. And then we can start getting a dagger so we don't have to keep stabbing ourselves. So yeah, slowly moving forward. All right. So let's make this dagger. Let's put an dagger to that. Make an iron sword. I think I have enough blood. Let's see what's going to happen here. I don't want this one right now. So I want to think of a way to do like a very quick, easy mob farm that can turn on and off. And now we've got that sword. So. Sweet. Let's set up a quick little mob farm. All right. So I made this really janky little temporary farm. I think will work. <laughs> um, this is my first time using the mob duplicator, but it needs experience. And yeah, I've got experience. I put this in here with a zombie and then turn it on. Should work. Yeah. Let's see, is this going to work? Oh, yeah, it does work. Okay. Cool. Well, we got that set up. All right. So, learn from me. Um, do not put a whole stack of stone in here because if you take it out, you lose all your progress and it takes a whole bunch of time. But with that being said, I now got a stack of blank slates. Yeah, mistakes were made. All right, so let's make some reinforced slate now. Let's take a half stack. Uh, let's, take, let's take 15. The last time I took, oh, let's... Um, where'd they go? Well, I'll go like this. Uh, one second. So I realized what I did there with my filter, it was taking out the blank slates instead of the reinforced slates. So now, give me that. And I'll have a wrench. So give you this. And then get rid of the blank slate for now and add that. There we go. Did I just waste all of those? Oh no, they're back here. Okay. Let's get this some more blood. Oh, yeah. 
and we'll be right back. All right, so now it's time for the tier three altar. Hopefully it doesn't mess up my setup here too much. Um, so to do that, it's like this. So we have our middle thing, we have an air block around another set, and I think we need a glowstone on top of these pillars. So let's build that right now. All right, so I set up the tier three altar. Um, my mob farm won't work anymore. It's unfortunate, I thought they were flat, but no, they have to go down. Um, so I had a little bit of essence stored. This is the only way I can figure out how to get it in there, <laughs> which is a little interesting. It was working before. Hmm. Well, it was taking it from there. I'm a little confused now why it's not. But let's just keep going on, shall we? I swear this was working a second ago. Well, that's good. I have blood everywhere now. Where is the source? Um, excuse me. I'll be right back. All right. After a little bit of fiddling around, I finally got my mob system set back up. Does it look pretty? Not really. Um, so I will need to find a way to get like this like XP coming in automatically. But for now, it kind of does the trick. So I'll show you. Like I'm full of blood, but I can just turn it on. And just spawn just one for now. And bam. So yeah, that worked. I'm going to try to get some more runes and then set up the next tier of altar. All right, so I got everything set up for the tier four altar, but then I have to start getting into rituals and stuff, which I really don't want to do yet. So uh, I think that's it for today. I'll see you guys again next week. And all right, bye-bye.